So you always want to make sure that your funnel is clear of any debris that may prevent moisture from getting into your, your inner tube. Leaves or bugs or, you know, dirt, trash, any of that kind of stuff, you want to keep that out of here. A lot of times you'll have just a little bit of moisture in the bottom of the gauge that won't even get up to one one hundredth of an inch. And we call that a trace. So when you go onto the website and record, you'll record a trace which will show up as T on the website for trace. If you get any dew or frost, that does not count as precipitation and we don't record that into the precipitation recording. So my Kokoraz gauge is at my office. And so I've set it up at a place where I drive by it every day so that I see it and that I remember to check it and record. And it's a good thing to make sure that your gauge is in a place where you're always gonna see it and remember it. Because if it's out of the way and you have to go to a place where you don't walk by very much or you don't drive by, you may forget to record on a consistent basis.